på det dukker ikke opp noen videoer der. Ok. Nå står det live der. Det står live der, ja. Ok. Ok. Ja, ok. We are live. Welcome to uh, Archaicus presentation of our new uh, release. <laughs> there we are. Yeah. Hello. Hi there. <laughs> Welcome to the, this uh, presentation of our new music video that we are releasing today, Friday the 18th of August. I'm uh, Michael, the songwriter and guitarist of Archaica, and this is my Faithful sidekick Tobias Jakobsen, who uh, starred as an actor in uh, this uh, video that we made. Mm -hmm. uh, available now on our YouTube uh, channel for everyone to see. So I'm gonna give you a little uh, backstory about uh, how we did this. And, uh, and uh, this is obviously the song Mystical Death from our uh, album from 2022 that we released on 1st of April and it's the track uh, Mystical Death. So uh, we are uh, gonna explain a little. So for a long time I had like a vision of uh, recreating one of the Greek mythologies, the one of Theseus and the Minotaur and I had an idea this, that this song mystical death would kind of fit to this uh, this uh, thing. I always had this like uh, thought that uh, Archaica's <coughs> artistic expression would fit well with the uh, Greek mythologies since uh, the thing that stands the test of time are a central part of our vision so to speak so the Greek mythologies fit very well there. Uh, so I'm gonna make a long story kind of short um, the story is that I spent the last winter in the Canary Islands on a different music project and I thought that uh, I went on some uh, bike excursions and I saw that uh, this place reminds me of Crete or it fools me enough to look like uh, Crete or the Greek islands. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna show you some pictures so I thought that this place would fool me at least to look like uh, this um, could replicate the shores of Crete. This isn't Crete, this is the Canary island of Puerta Ventura. This is what it looks like and uh, to me this uh, looks fairly similar to Greece. Not that I can really give an opinion on it because I've never been to Greece but can work for a uh, music video, in my opinion. What do you think? Does it look like Greece? Have you been there? Yes, I've been there once. Does it look like Greece? Mm, a bit. Not much. A bit? Not much. Yeah. Okay, well, we failed. Okay. <laughs> no, no, we did, uh, we did well. We did well. No worries. <laughs> okay. It's okay. It's okay. I think it's cool. Well, you be the judge. You tell us. Tell us if it's cool or if it's not cool. You yeah. be the judge, okay? Uh, okay, so. Um, after a while I figure out that, uh, hey, music videos are kind of expensive. Oh, who would have thought? Well, okay. But I uh, met uh, some people that became uh, good friends. Fred and uh, Julia from the island of Fuerteventura. They uh, collaborated with us and uh, much like myself, they were uh, escaping the coldness of Northern Europe for uh, the warmth of the Canary Islands. So we found out, out that we have a lot in common and we made something work together. Uh, so none of us in this uh, project are professional actors, or are you? Do you consider yourself a professional actor? Not really. Not really? Uh, it worked. I do. No, do you? No, not, not really. really. Not really. No, no, not no. really. But it was uh, good fun. It was just a bunch of <laughs> friends, really. It's, I don't <coughs> consider this like... It's just a bunch of friends getting together, making some uh, something, fun. some fun. Action fool. There we call it art. Yeah. Are we that? Uh, are we that sophisticated? I think so. I think so. Let's pretend we are. Yes, we do. Okay. Uh, so, uh, so the theme of this release, as we said, this is recreating the story of Theseus versus the Minotaur. It's not really a direct copy of the story I'd say it's more like my own version it's the version of uh, it's Theseus versus the Minotaur uh, with some elements of I'll show you 
If you notice, this is the Ricard Wagner. This is the ring, this Nibelungen, where you have a uh, part where uh, you have a sword that is broken and then it's reforged again. And this uh, theme goes uh, in many different mythologies. It's also a theme in Lord of the Rings. This is very similar to Lord of the Rings. You might recognize the sword we're using in the video that we'll show you very soon. Mm. Yeah. But uh, this is a theme that uh, often repeats in many mythologies and these kinds of stories. So we, we included this. Uh, this is not really included in the original version of the story in uh, the Greek mythology, but we included this. Uh, okay, so um, before we uh, show you the video, uh, we have uh, Tobias here. You, um, he uh, played the part of the Minotaur, of course, Minotaur, you can yeah. see. Yeah, big guy. Big, cozy, <laughs> hairy Minotaur, perfect for the role. <laughs> Just uh, called him uh, to be asked. Do you want to come down and play Minotaur on the Canary Islands? And I told yes, of course. Of that would course. be fun. What don't you do as a good friend? Yeah, right? Yeah, that's correct. Yes. You do nothing. So, uh, how was this experience? Was it okay? It was very cool. Very okay. Yes, everything was well. I think we'll uh, we'll show the video now. You can judge for yourself, and then uh, we'll do some more interviews after we show the video. So enjoy. enjoy without without uh, further ado, the music video for Archaica's mystical death. Enjoy. Enjoy.
two, three. Thank you very much. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed uh, this as much as we enjoyed to uh, create this. So yes. uh, this was uh, fun, but also not quite without suffering and yeah. uh, consequences. <laughs> oh yes, of course. Of course. Um, I'm gonna film a little now. Uh, I, I don't remember quite what happened, but we were scouting for locations, and in Gran Canaria you have many, you have some mountains. mountains. Um, yes, um, yeah, we went for a hike. Yes, a big hike. <laughs> a big hike. <laughs> and uh, well, I'm going to show you the result, the result of, uh, of all of this. In the end. Let's look at what happened to uh, Tobias when he... Uh, <coughs> When he after his walk to the mountains, yeah, yeah, his knee was messed up pretty bad. So this is the result. <laughs> well, how many? I don't know. Do you needed to be uh, in a wheelchair to the to the airport? I remember this. This was you. <laughs> yes, it was a long trip. <laughs> well, it worked. I was getting safely home. Yes, you got home. Yes. Well. We uh, managed to get you home at least, yeah. uh, even though I killed you with a sword. So <laughs> 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 yeah, well, that's what actor me. Yeah, that's it. Oh, it's not real. Yeah, no, it's not real. The real part is was just acting. Uh, and <laughs> just um, let's see. Where do we have the hammer? Yes. Yeah, we have it there. Okay. Yes. Uh, and uh, of course, to be honest, he got some of the props uh, back to uh, Norway, where we usually are uh, located. Uh, but uh, that too was a bit of a struggle because the flight company flew it, it uh, became bankrupt uh, yeah. just out of operation <laughs> two days or something after his flight back to Norway yes. if I remember correctly one day was it I think mm. after so it was uh, quite the struggle to get uh, his suitcase got lost in the airport and everything and uh, for some reason uh, this uh, hammer and uh, a lot of the props and costumes ended up in Stavanger, uh, <laughs> the city of Stavanger, okay. with uh, three swords. They have a lot of this, uh, yeah, northern mythologies, uh, statues yeah, and the such. Viking swords, yeah. That's so maybe, it's. maybe that's why this hammer ended there. <laughs> 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 yeah. All the time. You've seen the movies, I guess. Yeah. Uh, Thor was probably uh, in Stavanger, so uh, this he, hammer ended up he, there. He stole it, I think. Probably. <laughs> well, yeah. Well, the story is that uh, my street where I live, they have the similar street in Stavanger, so they ended up, and it's far away from where I live, but uh, well, it ended up there somehow. But now we have it back. <laughs> also with my costume. <laughs> I only had to do this really, and then it came came back. Yeah. Yeah. Magic. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> well, yeah. It's. Um, um, it's uh, a lot of uh, problems uh, doing a uh, music video, a lot of issues you have to deal with. Uh, one is that uh, Gran Canaria is not an easy place to ship things to in general. Like swords are not, uh, they don't allow to send swords and stuff like this if it's not properly done. So always a lot of, uh, of uh, trouble. A lot of issues, but uh, all in all, uh, are you happy with? Uh, <laughs> well, I'm happy with the movie, music. Yeah. My costume is back. A week of uh, vacation. Oh, more that or less. was nice. It was what I needed. Mostly, yeah. yeah. A good vacation. I think we we all needed that. I'm gonna yeah. sh I'm gonna show you a bit from the mountain uh, there when we were scouting. Oh uh, yeah, that part. That would be nice to show. Yeah. When we were scouting for uh, locations, uh, locations, it was all over. We were all over the place. Yeah, we did have that kind of movie. Yeah, I was very for the fun part. Yeah, it was. I had to replicate uh, the epic scene from uh, Rocky. Rocky, Rocky, of course. Yeah. When, that part. when we are in the mountains. We did have a lot of fun up there. Yeah, okay, so it was a good experience for yes, you? Yes, it was. A lot of walking all over. It was nice. Yeah. Was it 
800 meters over the ocean? Or? I think it was a thousand or something and we, we ended up using the lo location you saw for Pro Prometheus uh, that's uh, Hugo, the, he's a native of uh, the Gran Canaria Islands, he lives there. Mm -hmm. uh, we used this location uh, when he hurt his knee. Yeah. So there was real pain <laughs> and suffering in this. Still hurts, but it's okay. Alright. <laughs> Victoria, do you want to share something with us? Do you want to switch places with uh, Tobias? Yeah. We're gonna get, get, uh, get the <laughs> actor. Switch. We're gonna get the actor for uh, Princess Ariadne. Yeah. This part, the the princess that helps Theseus into the cave to find find the Minotaur. Hello, Victoria. Hello. Uh, hello. How was? Uh, did you enjoy uh, playing uh, Princess Ariadne? Was it okay? Ooh. Yeah, really much. <laughs> and uh, we know that uh, usually you do uh, cosplaying in your spare That's time. That's true. How uh, how was was this different from cosplaying? Was this any different? Mm, well, not really, because you have to play a character. That's what I do when I do cosplay. You like find a character you like and you want to be, and uh, then you can like join contest, and then you have to be in the role of the character you are. Okay, so you have uh, some experience. So there. I have some experience, and I have also done some smaller music videos. Bit like other cosplayers, nice. uh, and I have done something on TV with a cosplay, okay. something called Farman. Farman, that's a Norwegian TV yeah. series. Yeah. So I was a, a background character there okay. for the markets. So I, I have done some on TV also. Well, that's nice. Well, we're all uh, more or less amateurs here, but uh, we all used some of our uh, hobbies from. Uh, our personal life in order to to do this so uh, I think mm. the, the only person who has done acting before is actually uh, the person who played uh, Prometheus Hugo he has been an actor before he has uh, actors in his family and so, and so forth uh, but we're all more or less amateurs I would say I, mm. I never did acting before but this was like uh, more of a movie for me because Similar there was so many production takes we had to do and uh, you have to go like back and forth back and forth okay go go there go yeah. back go there go I back i think in the movie and, you, ha you have to spend the whole year or two yeah so, so, it's so this was like a shorter th this is short movie this is five minutes in the movie you yeah. have to spend a year or something yeah but uh, i had blood sweat and tears so yay Yes, like I said, we all had to uh, suffer a bit uh, to yeah. make art, but uh, suffering creates great art, uh, does it not? Yeah, me too. I uh, did some takes in a cave. Yes, yeah, what happened? And it wasn't my character even. Really? No. Yes, and uh, what happened? Well, I had to. Um, I came in the cave with the uh, sword and uh, shield yes that's the that's the character uh, that's I don't think it's originally included in the no. myth of the thesis and the minotaur but I wanted to include it uh, just to make my own version I felt mm. it fitted in like uh, Theseus is defeated the first time when he has his spear and like I said this is this is uh, more from Wagner inspired than uh, the Thesis and the Minotaur. So mm. he gets his spear, spear broken in half. Go away with the spear. He lies dying on the ground. And then you have this uh, divine type of Mother Mary character that creates the new weapons. And uh, th this uh, theme is found in a lot of mythologies and such. So that was that character. So you uh, had to. What happened to you? You got. The cave fell down? Yeah, because I had to go longer in the cave and then uh, the sword like uh, touched the ceiling okay. of the cave yeah. and I just some small stones just fall. Very dramatic. Yeah, and uh, first it was like a couple of stones, but like after the sword touched more of the ceiling because I have to go longer in the cave. Yes. And then I just boof! Yes. <laughs> yeah. Many, many, many stones, and I just like 
hide because I didn't want it yeah. to uh, touch my face. Even as a divine so. character, you cannot be graceful. You're still clumsy. Yeah. It's good that you are you. That's the way we like you, Victoria. <laughs> thank, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, maybe we'll have some words. Do you want to have some words, Eliana? Uh, thanks have, for being in the video. you just want to sit there? It's up Hi. to you. Thanks for being <laughs> in the <laughs> music video. I really liked it a lot. Okay. We'll do that. And so you can uh, follow me on all my social medias. What's your social media? Uh, I have a YouTube channel, it's Wikitopia, and I have a TikTok, it's Viola uh, Lulu and then underscore Queen13. Uh, it's all in the YouTube uh, video. Yeah, we, everything is there. Check out uh, Archaica on uh, YouTube. I linked uh, everything there. Richard and Instagram, Wiki Candy, and yeah. Snapchat, Sweetie Wiki. So, yeah, but all of that is in and, the information. Uh, we have to say special thanks to uh, Eliana for making the beautiful uh, Pandora's box for the video, the one that opens and lets out all the scary stuff. Uh, very nice job. Thank you very much. <laughs> and uh, yeah, one special thanks also to uh, Centro Guayadeque. That's the actually a restaurant that we used to film um, film uh, some of uh, this stuff. I'll see if I have some videos uh, here. Yeah, here is the here is a picture of the restaurant. That's uh, me and uh, Magda, Pasha Magda, who play the character of uh, the Divine Mother Kundalini. This is a restaurant up in the mountains of uh, Gran Canaria. A very nice place if you have the chance to visit there. El Centro Guayadeque, a very cool restaurant. Uh, we also did, here, is, here are the guys and girls together, Tobias, Magda, me. Michael and Victoria, the whole cast together. Ooh. We actually uh, booked the camping for all the forging uh, scenes of the sword that uh, Magda did. <coughs> and uh, let's see what else we got here. I think I got some more. Yeah, this is the one I talked about with uh, in the mountains where uh, Tobias and I were looking for locations. This is Hugo, also a musician partner of mine. He uh, did his part very well, so this is up in the mountains of Gran Canaria. And if you are wondering what I am doing, I am making a scar on Hugo. Yes, 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 and of course all the people watching are very sophisticated and uh, no knowledgeable about uh, mythology, so you all know that Prometheus has his liver uh, eaten up by a bird every day, so this is the scar, very well done. Mm. Victoria, well done. <gasps> And each day it regrows. Alright, I hope you enjoyed the video. Here uh, I'll show you a picture of the box if you did not. This is the box that Eliana made. Very nice. Uh, if you wanna watch the video again, go to archaicaband.com or uh, search for us on uh, YouTube. Archaic uh, Mystical Death is our new video. Okay, I think that's good for now. You can uh, watch the video again uh, on YouTube as much as you like, share and all of this stuff for now until we make something cool again. Thanks and good night and keep rocking and playing heavy metal and listening to heavy metal. <laughs> Cheers! See you! Bye. 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 Thank you!